Hey everyone, this is Logan Davis, and welcome back to my channel. And finally, the first part of my new, mo new movie, sorry, <clears throat> my new movie is finally coming out. Sorry it took so long, I'm just working out the kinks a little bit for the first part. I already had the second part, part uh, gun down in the third part, but I just needed to work on the first part and how this entire thing is going to all of it's gonna star, all of it, how it's gonna be a giant problem for the, uh, from everyone, and how, um, everyone, all the heroes are gonna stop this problem and figure it out. So, so, and, um, so yeah, so, um, yeah, so, thank you all again for your patience, and, um, this movie um, feels like a great idea, considering since that Shadow is probably one of my more underused characters, since he doesn't really do anything in my videos, other than just, I don't know, basically his old characters is kind of being a jerk, honestly. But I felt like that was basically doing Shadow wrong, and I just don't see, I, I'm sure lots of Shadow fans and Sonic fans all alike just don't see Shadow as maybe a giant jerk or an edgy jerk or something like that. So I want to change Shadow's character up a little bit for this movie, and so, and maybe in a, some other future episodes. So, thank you all for your patience, support, and I'm happy to make this movie come to life now. So, without further ado, this is Sonic the Hedgehog, uh, Sonic Plush the Movie, Shadow's Last Stand, Part 1. Let's go. Oh, yes, yes, yes! Sir, what are you yesing about now? I'm trying to go to sleep. Oh, I'm sorry, robot. I didn't know you were sleeping at three o'clock in the afternoon! Are you even listening to me anymore? I wish I wasn't. Whatever, I don't need your sass. But looky here, robot, though. One of my most greatest creations yet. Now, I know what you're thinking. It may just look like a giant Toy Story blanket, but it's not! It looks like gelatin. Oh, kind of. It's a blob! Oh, when I blob, when I release this blob out into the world, it will cross mass destruction. Yes. This is gonna be probably one of my greatest ideas of all time! Yeah, yeah, you always say that. What do you mean? Well, you always say, This is one of my greatest inventions of all time, and it always just ends up as a big disaster for you. Sonic and someone who knows stops you. Oh, but this one's different. With this idea and this great invention, this can just take all away all of my problems at once. Really? Alright, now you got my interest. Oh, I knew I would. See, this blob can take any living force that it can and absorb its intelligence. Powers, strengths, and knowledge, and use it against the other people, and just use it to their, well, you know, abuse the power, and use it to make it an unstoppable force. Wow, this actually does sound like a great idea for once. Thank you! Now, I just need to add one more tiny drop of something. Hmm. Go get the horse from the basement. What horse? There's a horse in the basement, go get it. Let me go! No! Where am I? Oh, hello, Princess Twilight Sparkle. You? What am I doing here? Oh, you see, I need your little unicorn power, Alicorn. Hmm? I mean, Alicorn, it's a mix between unicorn and then, like, a Pegasus. Don't care! I need your powers to make my greatest creation yet <laughs> unstoppable to the max. Is that a giant blob of gelatin? It's not gelatin! It's a blob! Big difference. Kind of. Mostly. Sort of? Shut up, we're not discussing this. Oh, this blob will be the most unstoppable force, and I need your powers to do so, so I can finally destroy Sonic and his stupid friends. Oh, forget that. I'm going back to my universe. Oh, I, I don't think you are, Missy. <laughs> oh, no! uh, uh. Now, we can do this easy way the hard way. You use some of your magic to make my blob unstoppable, and I'll release you and teleport you back to your other dimension. But, if you don't, well, mm -hmm. let's just say there's... Mass consequences. Uh, what kind of consequences? 
Oh ho ho. Some you don't even know. Maybe. Oh yeah. I'm all out of glue. No 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 not anything with that Do what I say or I'll turn you into glue Okay, okay, please just don't uh, I'll use I'll use my magic. Don't turn me into glue. Okay then. Go ahead. Do your worst. Or your best, who knows? Forget this, I'm going back to my dimension. Oh no. So oh, this is a water door. Oh. 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 Oh, what happened? Oh. <sighs> Oh, yes! It worked! Oh, yeah! Let's do the Eggman! Let's not. Mm. Alright, Blob, as your commander, I command you to go get Sonic and his stupid friends. <sighs> what do you mean you're not gonna listen to me? I'm your master! I created you! You can understand this, Bub? Of course I can. I created it. I can speak blob. You listen to me! <laughs> Why, you sack of... <laughs> listen to me right now! I am your master, and you will listen to me! <laughs> I think you might have just ticked him off, sir. Well, this isn't good. <laughs> oh, please! <laughs> Meanwhile, come on, yes, I'm gonna win, yes. No, I refuse to lose again. Yes, total own it. Uh, I can't believe you won again. <laughs> yeah. Looking for a round two, bud? No, it's fine, I'll pass on the round two. Hey, Shadow, you feeling okay? You sound a little... What's the word? <laughs> Yeah, I I'm fine, Hedgehog. I just need a little walk, that's all. Hmm, what is the deal with this? Eh, hold on. Time to play some Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl, because everyone loves that game. Mr. Shadow, are you okay? No. Well, what's wrong? Ciao. Green, <sighs> uh, I'm gonna ask you an honest question. And I want you to be honest with me, okay? Uh-huh. Am I a jerk? Oh, well, let's see. Well, um... Well, um... Um, well, <coughs> well, uh, um, <laughs> thought so. Oh, what's wrong with, I don't know, being a jerk? I thought that was your whole thing, Mr. Shadow. Not that I like you being a jerk sometimes, but, you know, I thought you were all edgy or something like that. That's the problem, Grim. I don't want to be edgy anymore. I... You want to know what my real problem is? I don't feel important. What do you mean, don't feel important? I feel like no one needs me anymore. I'm not real. I just feel like a not real hero, you know? Sure, I sort of saved everyone, but not... You know, the whole... Alien lizard thing in space and stuff like that, and you know, back in you know a little bit. I don't know if you don't if you know or not, but you get the whole point. No point is is that after that, I just kind of didn't really do anything. Had a whole existential crisis. Had amnesia. Now I just feel like a lonely jerk who literally has 
Nothing left to live for. That's just simply not true, Mr. Shadow. I think you have a lot to live for. Like what? Well, you're a good friend and, well, you help sometimes. Well, hmm, that's the last time you helped. Oh, you, you're a good friend. Well, that's very reassuring. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Shadow. I'm just trying to help. Do me a favor. Don't. Just leave me be and let me die alone like I should have done. Oh. What do we do, Chief? Can't just leave him here to mope all the time. Ciao. Hmm. I got it. All right, Mr. Shadow. You want to help people? I got the perfect idea for you. Uh, really? You do? Sure. You can help people in a lot of ways, like helping people across the street, or helping someone with homework, or... I don't know. Maybe even donating to charity or something? Mm, I suppose, but... How would I start? Like, what should I do? Like, what do I do first? Mr. Shadow, I've got the perfect idea. I'm gonna go through a few things on help to help you make a better person. Really? Yep. Let's go. Oh, where are we going? On to step one. Step number one. Helping people. Now, over there is my mom. Go help her cross the street. Why? Because it's helping, Shadow. <sighs> Fine, I guess I'll do it, whatever. Do I get money? No. What do I get out of this? The benefit and the good feeling of helping others. This is a little bar barnacles, but whatever. Uh, excuse me, miss. I couldn't help notice, but you could need some help crossing the street. May I help you? Maybe try not to talk like a robot. Well, I'm trying. Oh, sure. That'd be wonderful. Okay, then. Let's go. Then. <clears throat> Sorry. Let's go. Oh, but don't forget to look both ways before crossing the street. Why? That's why. Oh, yikes. What a mess. Hey, need some help crossing the street? Sure. Uh, got any other better ideas that won't get me injured? As a matter of fact, I do. Time to go on to... Step two, educating. See, when you're with a young child who has a very impressionable mind, you have to teach them the right things. Over here we have blue. Now I wanted to want you to teach them from right and wrong. Oh, that sounds boring. But I guess I'll do it. I have no choice. All right, kid. Let me get some things down. Real quick. All right, kid. Listen up. Guns aren't bad. In fact, guns are healthy for you. And you know what? Guns, when you kill, shoot people, they don't actually die. They respawn in like a video game. Wow, I didn't think of it like that. And also, drugs aren't horrible either. They actually taste good. I mean, that's what I've heard anyway. Do not listen to him. Clearly that failed, so we're gonna have to try step number three. I know I've only got five fingers, just go with it. Spending time with others, like friends and family. Now, you see over there? There's Mr. Big. Now, go fishing with him. I am not about to go f swimming with, or fishing with Big the Cat. Come on. <sighs> Fine, Mom. Go. Gee, so bossy. Still nothing. God, this is so freaking humiliating. Hey, Big. I can see that you're pretty lonely out here all by yourself. Could you... Do you need a fishing buddy or something like that? Well, Shadow, I didn't think you'd have to be my fishing buddy, but of course! Okay, so, um... Oh, shoot, I don't have a fishing pole. Oh, that's okay. I have a spare right here. Big? Yeah? These are a pair of Sony headphones. Yeah, but they got a little, you know, like one of these little things right here that can kind of be used as fishing rods. Do I seriously have to go fishing with him? Just do it. 
Okay, let's just get this over with. <clears throat> now, uh, now we have to wait. For how long? I don't know. Seriously? Just do it, Mr. Shadow. <sighs> okay, fine. I can wait. Whatever. See if I care. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Let's just wait. Two hours later. I have been fishing for two hours and nothing! When is the fish gonna come? You have to be patient. You know, these things are exactly easy. Fine, I can wait. Two very boring minutes later. Kill me. Oh, holy crap! Oh yes, I've got a bite! Finally! Oh, I hope it's a big one. Yeah. Visiony, visiony, you gotta get it! Yes, yes, I finally got a used half empty Gatorade bottle. <laughs> That's it, screw this, I'm out of here! Giant waste of my time! But, but Mr. Shadow, we didn't even get to step four yet! I don't care! Listen, Cream, I appreciate all of your help, but this is not gonna help me. I need to go. But... Ciao, ciao. Yeah, I know, I tried my best, but I just thought I could help him, you know? Um, I suppose there's nothing else I can do. Hmm. Come on, Cream. Mom's expecting us home. Let's go. Ciao. Oh well, even though Shadow's gone, that was pretty fun. And I had a new fishing buddy. Hmm. Why does the water look all weirdly blue all the time? I know it's supposed to be blue, but looks different than usual. Looks like jello. <laughs> Later. <sighs> well, this was a giant waste of my time. I just need to face it. I'm a disgrace. Ugh, such a little monster, aren't I? Yeah, that's where I am. Nothing. I'll never change. Nothing but just an edgy, dark jerk. I'll never change. I bet I couldn't even help someone if I could. This is hopeless. What do I do now? Ugh. What the heck is that noise? Ugh. Making the ground shake. Run! What the heck is going on? What the heck is going? Oh my god! Everybody run! No! Relax, jokes. Watch me punch this sucker. Sucker. Huh? That's funny. My hand's kind of stuck. We're all gonna die. Rock you fools! Let's get out of here! Joy! Oh, no! Laser remote! Why did not then? Whoa! What the HE double hockey sticks is going on here? Cream. Ah, no, you don't. Chaos control. Okay, I think we're fine. Oh, no, we're not. Oh, mother, help me. Oh, God, I'm screwed. What the? 
Who's driving the truck? <sighs> oh, oh, we. I did not know I could drive that. Tails? But he looks more weird than usual. I'll explain on the way. Right now, I need you to get in this truck. Not gonna happen. Mother says never get in a truck with strangers. Even if the strangers happen to be looking like my boyfriend. There's no time to argue. Boyfriend? You know what? Never mind. Just get in the truck, quickly. If you want to live, get in the truck. Maybe we should do what he says. <laughs> yep, do what he says. Get in the truck. But we're not all gonna fit in this. Oh, don't worry. It's a lot bigger on the inside. <laughs> what the heck? Where did he go? Oh! Mr. Shadow, where did you go? <laughs> oh, what the heck? Where are we? Inside the truck. Told you it was a lot bigger. Wow, this is weird. Yeah, I borrowed it for some weird guy who got eaten by this weird blob thing. Oh no, Mr. Factor got eaten too? Oh, great. Whatever. Just, um. Is that a Nintendo Switch? Why do you have that in here? Oh, it's the wheel. I wanna have a serious talk with Vector after this. <laughs> Quick, go, go, drive! Driving! <laughs> Can you drive this thing any faster? Oh, excuse me, Mr. Bossy. Look out! <laughs> you drive like an eight-year-old. What do you expect? I am an eight-year-old! And you can drive? I can drive a plane, so don't question it. <laughs> Where are we going anyway? Somewhere far away from this weird blob thing. I'll explain what's going on. <sighs> okay, safe to come out. <sighs> Alright guys, I drove far away from that thing, so I think we're safe. Sure about that? What do you mean? Look behind you. <sighs> uh, I, uh, didn't know that blob was that big. Oh no, I'm recording, we don't have anywhere else to go. Well, looks like we're dead. Oh well, I guess we, uh, we tried our best. She's gonna give up like that? I suppose so. Jeez, you're hopeless. Why did I come here in this universe just to find you? You did? Well, I would have explained it to you, but we're gonna die anyway, so why do, I, why do you care? I don't. You brought it up. Shut up! We're gonna die! <laughs> it's no use! Take this! Wait a minute, I know that voice. Silver! Hey, sub shadow! Hey. Quick, come on, let's go. We're gonna set somewhere safe. You know this guy? Yeah, he's my friend. Come on, let's go. Silver, where are we? Welcome to my shelter bunk. This is mostly the place where we go if there's like a hurricane or tornadoes or something. Forgive the mess, Charmy just likes to carry around some of the essentials. Sup? So I see you're dealing with that weird blue thing outside? Yeah, unfortunately. Still don't even know where that thing came from. Oh, you can thank this clown for it. Hey, bring him out. <laughs> make me in, of course. How original. Well, you make up an evil diabolical plan and see how you like it. Never all my life. Oh, this goon is the reason that the whole blob thing is coming and just eating us all. For what reason? I don't know. Start talking, punk. Oh, well, you, well, you see, he, I would, but I, I'm not really, you know, good with interrogation type stuff like this, you know? I suggest you start talking before I bang you against the wall. Okay, okay, okay. See, I created this blob in order to, whatever it absorbs, it, um, well... It uh, takes the powers, knowledge, and smartness, and intelligence, and basically just everything about the person who absorbs, and uses their uniqueness abilities against, well, others. 
like take Knuckles for example. He was eaten, right? And so, well, now he has about the strength of Knuckles. But uh, that means my blob is going to be a lot dumber now, because in sense, Knuckles is a uh, pretty bad IQ. Well, can't we just get Sonic to stop it like he always does? Can't happen, unfortunately. Almost everyone has been taken out by this blob, even Sonic. And I mean almost everyone. We, are, we lost Sonic, Knuckles, Big the Cat, even, even Vector and SBO. Gosh, what about you? <sighs> no, sorry. Oh. Well, is there any way we can stop this? Thing? <clears throat> hell, did someone forget I'm still here? Oh, right. Other tales from other dimension. You said you were gonna say something, right? Right. Since now we're not dead, let me explain. See, I come from a different universe where... Um, hmm. Well, how do I explain this? See, I come from this universe where the Sonic in my universe has blue arms and mm, a little bit furrier, realistic kind of type thing. But he doesn't have human teeth or something like that. No, no, no. But, well, let me explain. So... Um, here's the thing. So, recently, in my universe, I got this message from, like, on a whole different, like, from, like, I just got this weird signal on my computer saying, well, I need to come to this universe and warn you, Shadow, and the reason why you is beyond my expectations, I suppose, beyond what I know, anyway. Why specifically me? Well, hmm... I don't really know the answer to that, but not just you, I need to come warn all of you. This blob is no joke. This blob will consume almost everything in sight, including you all. And once, once it does that, practically, the world will fall. Well, that's terrible. Well, how do we stop it? Well, that's where you come in, Shadow. What, I, what do I have to do? See. We need, to, we need to go on this very dangerous journey. We need to cross hot deserts and lots of other stuff like that. And all around very dangerous obstacles in order to reach the very dangerous and protective Tower Tomb of Toys. This Temple of Toys is surrounded by a giant large sized TV with a bunch of toys laid on them. One being the mystical legend himself, the McDonald's Mickey and Minnie toy. <laughs> you are not serious. Is anyone actually believing this guy? Trust me, Shadow, you need to believe me. That toy is the only way that can save everyone. That toy has powers beyond your imagination. Legend has it. Anyone who attains this this um toy can, well, practically grant wishes and unlimited power. Kind of like a Master Emerald or something like that. But legend has it. Only a true hero of pure heart can use this shark for good and stop the evil blob. Well, you got the wrong guy for the job. I'm not pure of heart. But you can be, Mr. Shadow. Even if I wanted to, Cream, I can't. I'm no pure of heart. I'm just a jerk. That's not true, Mr. Shadow. I believe you can become pure of heart. How? Well, you need to show kindness, support, and help others. And not just think about your own selfish need. You can do that, can't you, Mr. Shadow? I, uh... Well... You know what? I think I'll give it a try. Yes! Well then, what are we waiting for? Let's go find the shark. Well, I'm glad I gave you a bunch of information. So I say yeah, yes, I'll see you later. Oh no, that's your blob. You're coming with us. Oh, come on! Hey, you caused it. You deal with it. I'm watching over you. I don't trust you. <laughs> oh, thank God. Oh... Thank goodness. Hey, uh, you want to join our group? Oh, sure. I guess so. What are we doing? We'll explain on the way. All right, everyone, let's go find this toy. Come on, Mama, let's go. Yeah. Come on, sweetheart, let's go. Hey, yo, wait for me. Come on, Blue, let's go. 
All right, come on, let's go, Pringles Can Man. Ugh, can this day get any worse? If it makes you feel better, the you and my universe flosses. I hate my life.